So now let's talk about the Vertrex Max. So you're wondering what's the difference with this one? Well, you can obviously tell right when you look at it that this one has a soft body and it has a, uh, you know, you get some action out of the tail and this one falls slightly slower than the Swimtrex Max. Uh, and it's just a different look. You know, it's, it's whenever you get around a lot of fish, sometimes uh, I would imagine like if I find a group of fish and say there's 50 bass out there, I might catch the first 10 on one, pick up a different one and catch another 10 and all of a sudden they stop biting. When you're like, well, I've already thrown all my normal lipless crankbaits at them. Well, then you, you throw this one in there and this one a lot of times it will surprise you that they'll bite this one when they won't bite any other one. And I don't know if it's just because the action in the tail or, uh, or the body. I know it's a lot of times they'll eat this one better for some reason I don't really know why I guess whenever they get it they have that soft body feel to it so they'll get a little bit better uh, they don't feel like they're eating a piece of plastic um, it casts just as far you can retrieve it the exact same ways as you do the the swim trek max except that like I said this one's just a different look a little different sound a little bit different vibrations coming through the water and it's just another version that's completely different in the lipless crankbait world you can throw at these bass